Chandigarh University students today celebrating National Science Day with the theme of Science and Technology for Specially Abled People. Let's quickly interact and find out about whole of this event. So today I feel immense pleasure in telling about why we are celebrating National Science Day, keeping the legacy of every year. Department of Applied Sciences is celebrating National Science Day on the eve of the invention of Dr. C. V. Raman's Raman Effect for which he was awarded with Nobel Prize in 1930 and this year the theme of National Science Day is Science and Technology for Specially Abled People. I am immensely impressed uh, by the level of understanding of science and technology among the students. This particular uh, National Science Day of 2017 uh, was dedicated to science and technology for the specially able. The university students had uh, made us proud uh, by meeting on one side the challenge of organizing this particular Science Day as a Science Day dedicated to uh, specially able. On the other hand, they have come out with wonderful ideas. We are the students of automobile and our project for National Science Day is a walking cane for the visually impaired. This uses a sensor technology. Uh, the sensors uh, detect any obstacle in front of the uh, blind person who is walking and this module produces a beep as well as a vibration just in case the person cannot hear also. It is, it is a really great experience. It is my first uh, science day presentation and my first working model. So I'm really excited about it. So first we have made about this organic farming. So for that thing we have made this organic farming project in which we are using just organic things only. We are not using any kind of pesticides or any kind of synthetic fertilizer but we are just using only the things which are made organically. We are using farmyard manures, vermicomposting and using the livestock excreta and all. Farmers are not able to produce higher amount of uh, production so they should divert to polyhouse and this uh, drip irrigation system. Then we have here monoculture and diversified farming showed here. Mono, in monoculture the soil degrades, water level goes down and diseases uh, continues year by year and in diversified farming there is a mixture of so many crops in monoculture there is a risk for uh, failure, crop failure and in diversified farming there are so many enterprises that if the if one enterprise fails then the others compensate for that thing i think that's an innovation in itself and uh... I see a lot of enthusiasm in students and faculty. I learn you, the university started uh, the science courses last year only. And for a one year old baby, it's a huge, huge growth. Though I know our uh, engineering disciplines are uh, pretty old, about 3,500 students in that. And, uh, it's good. I'm happy. Uh, the students have come up very innovative projects, uh, they've uh, gone to explore science behind food also, your hotel management students, they're working on the theme of the year, National Science Day. This year's theme is uh, science and technology for specially abled uh, people. They've uh, come up with very innovative ideas.